guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is a new in my wardrobe video this is very much a collective haul so I have a little bit of everything in here some dresses some sweaters and tops just a complete mix I'm also gonna be sharing with you the Fendi bag that I got if you watch my London vlog you'll know that I did a little bit of shopping at Fendi so I'm gonna be sharing with you the bag that I got then which I'm just so incredibly excited about it is just so beautiful so I will be doing that unboxing here as well so I hope you guys enjoy this and let's Let's get started. So first up, I want to share a bit more of a practical one, but I have found these bras, which have been a total game changer for me. These are so incredibly comfortable and they've pretty much just been saving me over the past couple of weeks. I am going through a bit of a growth spurt at the moment for obvious reasons and I'm not wanting to go get fitted for a proper bra because I just didn't know when my size would stabilize. I didn't want to waste any money on something that I could only potentially wear for a couple of weeks. So I've been holding off, but honestly, my previous bras are not cutting it anymore. I found these which are technically one size and I had a healthy dose of skepticism when I heard that but they are absolutely amazing. Like there is so much stretch but they are also so incredibly supportive. They are totally seamless and I'm pretty much just in love with these. So I have the black one and then also the nude one as well. The nude one is completely invisible under white t-shirts and I will um, show you an example like under a white tee. You can't see the lines or anything. It does have padding so you do have a nice bit of structure so it's suitable under pretty much everything, even your thinnest of materials. But there isn't too much padding, it's just enough to give you a nice shape. And then it just pulls on. The back is a very, very kind of soft spandex. And these are legitimately the most comfortable bras I think I've ever tried. Very similar to the True & Co ones, but these have a little bit more structure and a bit more support, which previously support wasn't really a thing for me, um, but now I'm really appreciating the beauty of a very good supportive bra. And these have just been absolutely amazing. They are all I've been wearing, and I honestly don't know how I was getting dressed before without them. So I would highly recommend, great for maternity. I also think that these would be great if you're not pregnant at all. They are just incredibly comfy, so supportive and completely seamless as well. And I'm just absolutely obsessed. Um, so we would highly, highly recommend. These have just been the best things for me. So these bras are actually from Lily Silk who are nice enough to part sponsor this video. And they are currently having their 12 year anniversary and they have a whole bunch of celebrations for their anniversary. So there is an entire landing page which I will link below. And it's got everything from giveaways to exclusives to special offers, like all kinds of good stuff. So I will link that. Definitely a good one to check out if you like silk products like I do. They have a special offer in their pillowcase I saw. Just so many great things. They have also given me a discount code as well. So you can take an extra 12% off the entire site. They did give me a dedicated code, so I will pop that on screen. And I'll also pop all the details in the description section. But they also gave me a separate discount code as well where I think this is buy one and get one item 25% off and that's a different code. I know there's a lot going on um, so again I will pop everything in the description section and I'll also pin everything to a top comment. I also wanted to quickly mention a previous item that I already own and love which is also fully in stock at the moment and it's included in the discount codes. I absolutely love this thing and I think I got this either one or two years ago. Um, it's a fully silk skirt, but it is the most beautiful thing. You guys will know how much I love my polka dots, and this has just been a mainstay in my wardrobe. It is just the loveliest thing. It has a beautiful flow. It doesn't crease badly either, which is always a must for me when it comes to any item really, but particularly summer skirts, which can get kind of wrinkly and worn, but this has excellent kind of fabric integrity. 
and it is the cutest thing. It's just a simple black wrap with this beautiful kind of golden beige polka dot print. It still works in maternity as well because it does have like that kind of flexible wrapping, but obviously I got this when I wasn't pregnant and it fit great then as well. Just really, really flexible. I absolutely adore this and this one is also included in the discount code. And from old favorites to new favorites, this blouse is just the perfect, perfect silk blouse. If you like your very minimal items, which are just very classic and timeless, this is pretty much the perfect example of what it is. It is very, very simply cut. It drapes in the most beautiful way. It has a simple round neck. It is a short sleeve, and then it just kind of drapes and skims. It's slightly longer in the back than in the front. It is completely silk as well. The quality is absolutely gorgeous and it's just the most stunning thing. I love it because it is so comfortable, it's very breathable. I also got one for my mum as well, and I swear she's only had it like 10 days. I've seen her wear it five times in those 10 days. Like, she will not take it off, and every time I see her wear it again, I'm like, really again? And she's like, but it's just so cool. It's been ridiculously hot here, and she's like, it's so cool and breathable, but it still looks really elegant and chic. And I just think they're wonderful. My mum agrees. I feel like it works with every single age range. And I think it's just as beautiful with jeans as it is with a skirt. Like you can really dress it up or down because it is so simple and minimal as well. Just the most wonderful, wonderful blouse. It fits absolutely perfectly. And it's just so stunning. Um, so definitely a new favorite, an absolute wardrobe classic, beautiful quality and just completely timeless. And now for a black tank, which if you've seen me wearing a black tank over the past month or so, I'd say, there's a 95% chance it was this one. I have been living in this thing because it just goes with absolutely everything. I have been teaming this with everything from black leggings to faux leather leggings uh, to skirts as well. I imagine it would go really well with jeans. Like it is the perfect black tank top because it does just kind of drape and skim in the most beautiful way. I love the fact that it does have a higher neckline, but the sleeves aren't super highly cut either. So it's very movable. It doesn't cut you off and create any unflattering lines or anything like that. It skims down and it does have a slightly longer length of the back, but only very, very slightly. And this literally just goes with everything. It's a slightly thinner silk, um, but completely opaque as well, so you don't have to worry about your underwear showing. Very breathable, very light and airy, which has just been such a godsend recently, as I keep mentioning. It just zips up at the back, and I honestly cannot get enough of this top. It has been on constant rotation. It is just the most wonderful wardrobe basic, and just one of those items that you'll just get so much wear out of, like I have been, because it does seem to go with everything. And now for the skirt, which is the most beautiful thing. Um, so this kind of has like a pleated skirt effect. This pleats aren't rigid at all, and it has this absolutely beautiful chiffon layer. Again, it's 100% silk, and you do have a zip up at the back. So it is a proper kind of structured waistband. And it just flows out in the most beautiful way. It is double layered, um, so on the inside, you have this wonderfully soft fabric, obviously being silk, you expect it to be soft, but it feels incredible on the skin. It just kind of flows against you in a really lovely way. And then you do have that beautiful chiffon layer on top, which just adds a little bit of drama and volume. And I thought this was so beautiful. I believe this comes in the white as well. I went for the black, I always rely on my black pieces, you'll probably gather this by now. But I thought this would look super chic with any number of outfits, you know, you could team this with an all black top, you can belt it, you do a little waistcoat, a blazer, just so many different options. The quality is absolutely gorgeous. And again, one of those items which really doesn't date, you know, it's not super on trend, but it's something that you could literally wear for 10 years. And the quality is there, and I just love all the different styling options that come with this, so I am crazy, crazy excited for it. Just absolutely beautiful, and one of those items that I know I'm going to get so much wear out of. And then next up, this dream of a blouse, and the fabric on this is just so stunning. It is so silky soft, as you'd probably expect from 100% silk. But honestly, you just want to drape this over your skin because that's how nice it feels. I'm going to try and do a close-up so you can actually see the fabric, but it really is so lovely. Um, this one differs slightly from the first blouse I showed in that this one is a cap sleeve. So this is absolutely perfect for layering under blazers. It's always a bit unsightly when you try and tuck a kind of short sleeve or long sleeve item under a blazer and you do get those lumps and bumps. 
Whereas a cap sleeve is on quite a sleeveless item, so you do get a bit of sleeve, but you don't get all that excess bulk under a blazer. So this one is absolutely perfect for layering. Again, it just kind of drapes down in the most beautiful way, it never clings or anything like that. Wonderfully cool to wear, quality is absolutely beautiful. And this color I thought was stunning. It's a really beautiful kind of shimmery golden beige, really beautiful in summer with a cream skirt or a camel skirt, also very nice just with simple black. But I definitely think you could dress this up for the festive season as well. Like a really nice all year round color. And again, the fabric is just so beautiful. Like you're not gonna want to stop touching this. It is so dreamy and gorgeous and just the loveliest blouse. So as I mentioned, I will include links to everything I shared in the description section. I will also pin everything to a top comment and the codes I mentioned before work off everything. And they've also just launched their awesome collection, which is so beautiful. They have a whole landing page and the discount code does work on everything there too. So I will link that in the description section also. Next up is my Fendi unboxing and I am just crazy excited about this bag. I would also say you may have been able to gather from that vlog but I think this is like the best customer experience I've ever had and I find that the service at Chanel has always been absolutely fine but that is like the right word to use because I went into Fendi and keep in mind I don't actually shop in luxury stores that much like I usually order my things online and the service like blew me away everything from kind of being ushered in they offered us refreshments when we were leaving because it was so hot they're like can we give you bottles of water to take with you they were so patient she let me see everything that i wanted to suggested other items styling tips like it's honestly as if she couldn't do enough and obviously you know it's in their interest to sell things um but often in chanel and even sometimes louis vuitton i feel like it can feel like a little bit of an inconvenience when you ask to see other items, whereas that was not the case here at all. I went to the Fendi on Bond Street and it was just the most incredible experience. Like it really has made me a hardcore fan and it was just incredible. Um, so it just made this beautiful bag even better that the buying experience was so nice. So you do have the tissue paper right here. So first up, I do have a mini box. So this one's actually empty. There's nothing in it because it did house the scarf that I got as well, but she did tie it on the bag for me and I didn't want her to undo it because I didn't think I'd be able to do it as nicely as her. So she left it on, but she was nice enough to give me the box as well. If you want a little tutorial on how to wrap scarves over your bags, I will link that vlog because she was super nice and she let me film the whole thing. So I'll link that vlog if you want a mini tutorial, but it was super, super useful. And then here is the box. It's a full of tissue paper, so very, very well packaged. So here's the Fendi dust bag. And inside is the Fendi Peekaboo Petite. Um, so this is different from the Fendi Mini Peekaboo, which has a different shape. This is the new model that they released. I think it was only a couple of months ago, actually. Um, so this is the more kind of, it's a more true version of a shrunk down regular peekaboo, which I love. I previously owned that. And if I had a different lifestyle, I would still own it probably multiple colors because it is a beautiful bag. Um, I saw they released this one and I was like, oh my goodness, like I need to check it out. Um, this one comes in a whole bunch of different colors as you probably saw. I went for this beautiful pale pink one and they actually had two pale pink ones. So the first one I looked at had gold hardware and the pink was very pretty, but it was much more of a kind of candy color pink whereas this one was a little bit more muted and a bit warmer whereas the other pink was a bit cooler in tone and I like the fact they had the tortoise shell trimming on this one so I knew I wanted this one this was the one that I saw on the website and was actually a big reason why I wanted to go to London it was to check out this bag was very very happy that they had it and it is just absolutely beautiful. Um, so it is fully expandable as well. It does fit in my phone um, and you can undo these to really um, expand out and create a lot more room. She did tie that beautiful scarf as well. I love the combination and we tried a few different options with the scarf including the green one. But I loved the combination of the pink with just the hint of gray as well. I thought it was super pretty. It does come with the strap. So the strap is fully adjustable, which I always really like. And then it does come with its own little raincoat as well. Always a feature I love on the Fendi Pukaboos. I just think it's 
so great and clever and um, they do advise to use this as well to protect the bag from rain just to make sure there's no water damage or anything like that so you do just kind of pop that on top which I just think is so adorable. So on the one side it's just a plain wide open compartment and then on the other side you do have two little pocket slots right there as well as the main compartment. My main concern was 100% whether my phone would fit. I would mentioned this and she was like, fill up the bag by all means, you know, try it out, you know, mold it different ways. Genuinely, like, you could have spent hours in there, I don't think they would have minded. And they were like that with every single customer, like, whilst we were there, we saw so many customers come and go. And they all received just like the nicest, most polite and generous service. It was really incredible. And I'm just over the moon with this bag. Like, I think it's so beautiful. I'm so excited about it. I love everything from the detailing to how elegant the shape is. I love the scarf combination. And it's just my new favorite thing. Just so, so cute. Definitely a dinky size. Um, I think they also do this combination in the regular size as well. Um, but yeah, absolutely over the moon with it. And it was just such a nice experience shopping there. Next up is a dress and this is another one from my long lost Nordstrom package so again this one was featured in the end sale and it's not on sale anymore um, but as I previously mentioned a lot of the end sale items do end up going back on sale so if you're interested in it bookmark it it may well go on sale again and you don't want to pay full price that is but I love this like it is so gorgeous and I'm so happy this was found because this in particular was an expensive dress like I dithered about ordering it for a while went for it and it's just absolutely perfect and very much in keeping with what I like and um, so you can wear it two different ways you can wear it as a smocked sleeve dress um, but you can also wear it off the shoulder as well it does have a black bodice there is a decent amount of stretch so perfect if you have a growing baby bump but also works if you're not pregnant as well and then it just drapes down and you have this single tier the fabric is actually fairly structured and um, without being too heavy and only usually you have kind of like a pinstripe effect which you don't often see on a dress but it weirdly works and I just love everything from the cut to how it flows incredibly comfortable as well easy to dress up or down and just such a great little dress so very very happy this was eventually found um, I'm sorry it's so late um, but as I mentioned things often do go back on sale so I would definitely say to bookmark it if you are interested but yeah I could not be happier with this now for this dress and this is in a beautiful navy color i believe this comes in one other color as well i thought the navy was lovely though and this is a little bit more of a long one so pretty much a maxi dress definitely longer than your normal midi dress it flows in a really really lovely way so very drapey and soft very comfortable to wear as well also very breathable which is also nice for these very warm summers we're getting the detailing on the neckline is so pretty as well it just has this single ruffle detail not too much just adds a little bit of interest and the sleeves aren't adjustable but actually they fit really nicely without that and you do have this smock detailing around the waistline as well i'm just wearing mine a little bit higher up to accommodate the bump but obviously if you wanted to wear it non-pregnant you just wear it at your natural waistline I love this, incredibly comfortable, has pockets as well, always a way to win me over. Just a really, really nice, simple maxi dress, very cute by itself, but if you wanted to wear it when it does get a little bit colder, I think it would look super cute under a biker jacket as well. Next up is this beautiful dress, and I'm getting very excited about autumn, but when it comes to pieces like this, I will still get very, very excited, even in kind of mid to late August. I thought this was beautiful. The color is the prettiest thing. A really really nice berry red with like a hint of pink and then the floral print is a white daisy with a blue dot in the middle absolutely adorable really cute with white pink you know blue bags it kind of goes with everything because of all the different colors and then it is a smocked back as well you do have a thicker strap which is always nice for a change but like so many of my items are thinner strap ones whereas actually i think a thicker strap can be really really elegant too this one is a little bit looser around the middle so it's not a super tight fitting one but it just kind of flows down in a really lovely way just a really nice easygoing flowy piece and much like the last one really nice by itself when it is quite warm but also super cute under a biker jacket or any kind of jacket or blazer when it does get a little bit colder i just thought this was lovely and the color is the prettiest prettiest thing 
And then finally for dresses, I have this beautiful peach number. I bought this for a wedding we have to attend. We have one more wedding of the season. It's been a very, very busy year for weddings, I'm guessing because of all the rescheduling. And I needed something that fit me, which was also quite formal. So I did size up in this one, but I will also pop in my regular size in the description section. I thought this was beautiful though. I love the print and I do feel like it's kind of autumnal as well. So you probably wear this for an autumn wedding if you wanted to. The fabric is lovely. It's like a kind of crepe flowy fabric, really, really elegant. And then you do have this great peekaboo detail and it is a halter strap as well. It is super cute, very, very flowy. It is fully lined too, so it's beautiful quality. And I thought this colorway was stunning. Like it has this kind of watercolor effect on it. These beautiful greens and creams, like these burnt oranges, really, really elegant, a little bit different as well. And it just fits in a really nice way, even though I'm six months pregnant. Um, so I absolutely adore this, just so unbelievably beautiful. And I'm very, very excited to wear it. And now for a sweater pick, and this is a puff sleeve sweater, which I am very excited about. I think it's going to be another big trend for autumn winter, but this one is so much more wearable than other ones I found. I feel like puff sleeves, if they're too big in the shoulder, it can kind of give it like an 80s vibe, whereas this one is much more gentle in the shoulder, and most of the volume is kind of lower down, which really does help still keep on trend. At the same time, it makes it a lot more easy to pair and just more wearable in general. So it does have that great volume sleeve and then it kind of cinches down into a regular cuff sleeve at the bottom. It has a simple crew neck as well and then it just drapes down um, so it's not overly fussy in the body. The focus is very much on the sleeve. This one it does come in a whole bunch of different colours as well so if you're not as obsessed with iron with the black basics then you do have other colours to choose from. It's very soft as well. And it's just a really, really nice example of a volume sleeve sweater, which is cute and wearable on trend without being totally ridiculous and over the top. And last but not least, I have this fantastic top from Spanx. If you've not tried Spanx clothing, I would definitely recommend looking at what they offer. They don't have the biggest line, um, but the pieces I have, I love. And I'm not a fan of kind of Spanx undergarments. I find them incredibly uncomfortable. But their clothing pieces, I guess because they don't do that many, I've always been really impressed with. I love and swear by their faux leather leggings. I have some t-shirts from them, some tank tops, and every single piece has just been wonderful. So I was looking at some of their other items and I wanted a simple black top that I could wear with leggings that was just a little bit longer found this and it's pretty much perfect but I totally messed up the sizing so I sized up because I was like you know growing bump and everything but if I do eventually fit into this I think it's going to be like month nine and even then I'll only be able to wear it for a few weeks uh, so I definitely shouldn't have sized up as much as I did I went for the medium and it's absolutely enormous like it's way way too big so I am going to exchange this for a smaller size but I want to share it anyway because I'm really, really happy with just the fit and the overall look. Like, it's exactly what I wanted. Very, very simple. You do have the seam detail on both the front and the back. And then it just kind of drapes down. It is a bit longer in the back than it is the front. And you do have this very nice three-quarter length sleeve. Very simple. It's not overly fancy. Um, but as I said, I just wanted something to wear with leggings. That was just a little bit longer and this looked perfect pretty much exactly what I wanted. I just really shouldn't have sized up as much as I did. Um, so yeah, kind of happy with it, um, but I will probably find it a little bit more wearable once I do manage to size down. So that is it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. As usual, I will include links to everything I featured in the description section below. I also pin everything to a top comment and I will pop in my sizes for reference too. If you have any other questions for me, then leave me a comment. And please do give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy new My Wardrobe videos. As always, thank you so much for watching. I will see you in my next one. Bye, guys. Life goes up and it goes down. I know my mom taught me that I figured why we fool around so little and we keep track of time.